I wanted to show you the TP-Link AX1500 Wi-Fi 6 router. So this uh, router has uh, four antennas for TP-Link AX1500 routers. And there are four LAN ports, including one port. So there are Wi-Fi reset. There are Wi-Fi reset. Okay. So in the at the back, there are serial numbers and the Wi-Fi password. Okay. This is a power button. Yeah. And then one is power for power adapter. You need to connect it to the power adapter. I'll try to show you the how to, to connect the LAN cable to the one port. So this is the hat 6 cable. So I will try to connect to the one port. Adapter. The power adapter. So I'll try to connect it here. Okay, and okay, one five hundred next generation Wi Fi six router has a faster speed with Wi Fi six. Next generation faster Wi Fi speed to up to one point five gigabits per second. We have a uh, responsive processing. 1.5 GHz triple core CPU, full gigabit ports, and take full advantage for broadband speed up to 1 gigabit per second. This Wi Fi 6 uh, AX1500 has a vast, faster wireless connection. 4 streams Wi Fi offers connection at over 1 gigabit per second speed for newer mobile devices, reducing wait time by 30% while downloading huge files including 4K movies and games. 1.5 GHz triple core CPU, power and stable. Every click you make your model quicker. A 1.5 GHz triple core CPU handles data throughput up to multi gigs and minimizes uh, the latency within the home network, delivering your smooth experience. Has a gigabit ports, gigabit internet access, take a full advantage of your broadband with Speed up to 100 gigabit per second with a gigabit one port plug your PC, smart TV, and game console into your gigabit LAN port for fast and reliable wired connection. Then has a uh, two, two SSID, 2.4 gigahertz and 5 gigahertz with SSID one and SSID two. And smart connect. Archer AX can automatically assign your devices to the best available path according to the Wi-Fi environment, balancing the network load to give you each device to its optimum connection. So how to teach you how to set up the Wi-Fi 6 AX1500 on the network. So first is try to open or push the power button at the back of Wi-Fi 6 router. Turn on. As you can see there, the there are three lights or four lights, light green, indicating that they have uh, have a power. That is to how to uh, set up the X one five hundred wireless router on the network. So first step is to launch the web browser. Okay. Uh, IP address of the router which is 192.168.0.1 Okay. So okay so there have a login local password. So for now, I already logged in on my local password, so I already set up the local password. So all you have to do is to log in my local password. Okay.
Okay, so after I enter the password, so you can see there you have uh, uh, Archer AX10, which have uh, 2.4 G and 5 G gigahertz. These 2.4 and 5 G have a two SSID. So okay, so they have an internet connection already connected to the Archer AX10 and the client, which is a laptop. This is topology has a uh, check. To, to check if there's uh, internet connection on your AX10 wireless router. Okay, you have a dynamic IP, which is a dynamic IP and a MAC address of their lap of their laptop. Okay, you have a uh, wireless settings, and then you have to do is to try to click the quick setup. Okay, this is a select your time zone so first step is to uh, choose the your time zone here okay so I will try to click the Beijing Hong Kong and I will click next second step is to select the connection type on the connection type you need to have to click the auto detect or dynamic IP which is recommended to set to the wireless network okay and static IP so I'll try to choose the dynamic IP click next okay so for dynamic IP you have a default MAC address to set up the MAC address of your router okay so try to click next Okay, so the fourth step is to personalize the wireless settings. So, personalize wireless network name and needs to put your password with your SSID. Uh, for now, I try already login, enter the, uh, the network ID or SSID of uh, AX10 wireless. Okay, including the 5 gigahertz. So, try to click this one. Okay, for 5 gigahertz. So needs to enable it and try to put the SSID of the 5 gigahertz including your password. Okay. And try to click next. And the fifth step is to have to connection test of your internet connection. Okay, so just wait for a few seconds. Okay. Okay, so as you can see, this is a summary of your uh, configuration of your wireless network. So this is including the time zone, internet connection type, which is dynamic IP, and the wireless settings on the 2.4G and a 5G, which is a two radios for wireless network. Okay, including the SSID and the password. Okay, so next step is to click next. Okay, that's it. So this is the uh, optional. So if you need to have to have a cloud service in your uh, wireless in your phone, you need to access it. All you have to do is to to log in and set up it on your phone. Okay. For now, I try to skip this one. Okay, so this is for the uh, the this to the summary and this to have a internet LAN and this server. Okay, we have a quality of service. Just to configure it. If you try to try to have a quality of service of your network, including the security, you have a different option there. 
systems, needs to have thermal upgrade, backups restore, administration, time zone. If you have to check your the wireless, you need to have a diagnostic test. If you have needs to have to reboot your wireless, you have there. LED control in operation mode. So operation mode, you have a wireless router mode. You try to connect it to the from wireless router to your network, which is by default. Needs to have to choose this one. But if you have an access point mode, okay. So you need to have to configure it. But for now, you have you need to have to configure this wireless router mode, okay which is, is connected in our in my home network okay and next is the wireless okay as you can see this is uh, configured a while ago with 0.4 gigahertz and 5 gigahertz as we can have a 2 radio uh, for 2.45 gigahertz including we have a guest network if you haven't happened try to guess 2.45 needs to set up it if you have uh, needs to have decide to have a wireless guest network okay to have a network map okay so AX10 which is already connected to internet you have my lap is already connected to AX10 okay so okay that's it if you have uh, questions or suggestions just put in the comments below and don't forget to have to subscribe, like, and share. Okay, so so next step, you can verify the two SSID with 2.4 and 5 gigahertz. Okay, so please to check, try to check it. Okay, so as you can see, there are two SSID, 5 gigahertz and the 2.4. So if you check it. can verify it on the the, the two radio two, super, uh, 5G and 2.4G as you can see I already select the, the 5G okay and already connected the signal stretch excellent the link speed is 135 Mbps and the security is WPA2 PSK okay which is good so next step is I'll try to verify if my net internet connection have an improvement by using AX10 Wi-Fi 6 router. Okay, so I'll try to use the speed test to check the internet speed connection. Okay, so I'll click this one. Okay, the speed test is uh, have improved by using uh, Wi-Fi 6 router. Download Mbps is 24.8 Mbps and the upload is 23.8 Mbps.